everyone aiming for more cuphead expert mode going in for the devil on expert let's see how it goes hopefully um reasonably yeah we you know no wait no you say no we already did yes you get that doofy cutscene. It's real scary looking. You get the achievement. We don't need. We don't need to do that right now. I doubt it's any different on expert. A brawl is surely brewing. Oh, uh, what do we have equipped? Charge and spread. Still, I think. Oh hi. Oh, I forgot about those little demons. And how annoying they can be. And how uh, horrific that is. Whoa. And how sometimes I get hit by things I don't even know where they are when he does that. Uh, it's just a nightmare. Oh, I had to jump over the guy. And then get over the arms. Whoa, how much HP does he have? There he goes. There he goes. There he goes. He's gone. Just go down with him. I right, took one hit on the first stage because he had a, just a remarkable amount of health. I think spread shot time, just because it's so easy to hit him here. Just like his entire face. Oh, the axes are moving weird. Okay, good to know. Woo. Also, we should just pop that so we can continue to charge up more more charge. Stop, stop. I moved into the poker chip. Dude, we're halfway through. He has a lot of... <laughs> it's just, he has a lot of health. Is that just me? Might be reasonable to use charge shot. Ugh, might be reasonable to use the charge shot. Wh excuse me? Ugh, because it might be reasonable to use the charge shot against that second stage there. It's still good damage. We have to jump around a lot. Probably better just to... Uh, just like last time, probably better just to... Use our spread shot, because it's easier to hit him. We don't have to use as much concentration, focusing on charging and releasing the charge. I think uh, one of the imps got me. <sighs> why is there a foreground? Although I kind of understand why it's on the edges, because then that makes it look like it does this abruptly end. There's a foreground in the way. Use that transition to the end of the screen. Oh, hi, kitty. Okay, okay. That's not... Don't do that to me. You're cute. I'm sitting on the chair. So I have the cat right behind me because he's sitting in the chair first when I got here and I don't have the heart to kick him out. So I'm just sitting on the edge of the seat. Take a picture of the seat like the judge. Um, sitting in the edge of the chair. And then he just reaches his claws out and starts scratching my arm. And I'm using when you cut it out. He's still doing it. Or I don't like the spider attack, it's kind of hard to hit him. Why would you jump so early? Oh, oh the inconsistency of that attack. And then I ran right into the fight. You know what? I'm just going to retry again. But I'm not happy with how the fight's going, might as well just reset it. If I remember right, I felt like this... Uh, Alright, I shouldn't retry every single time, because then we never get any practice in. But I do remember feeling like the first stage was like the, possibly the hardest stage of this uh, devil fight. Wait, he, it's an inconsistent, sometimes it's light speed, sometimes it takes 20 minutes to slap you with those arms. Little Mr. Fantastic arms. Oh, I dodged. Get out of here, that. Whew. Oh, I had that. I thought he was doing the other fire summon attack. Ooh, is he close? Yeah, he's getting pretty close. He does have a lot of health. In this. He probably has a lot of health period. He is the final boss after all. And he's on expert mode. Dude, the imps. This is a constant barrage of imps. 
trying to fight the boss, and there's just imps all over me. Alright, snake head. Ooh. Attack, which I don't feel I can consistently dodge for some reason. Alright, you see like that. It's so slow. Although if you told me it was all actually the same at speed, and I'm just crazy, and just a perceptive matter, then I totally believe it. Where's his imps? Is he done? Is he, is he supposed to be going to the next phase? I don't see any imps. Yeah, there he goes. And down we go. One HP. I should have jumped there away and just let it explode. Uh, that's a really terrifying little death art I didn't notice before. That was horrifying. If I die again, we'll take a second to appreciate that. I just... I'm so tilted immediately. I'm just scary spider head, bouncing around. You can dodge this thing, gets damage in there. Much better than we're doing that first time. Oh, there's so much going on. All right, hey, we're getting much better this stage. Uh, getting him, getting him down earlier. That way, ideally, we'd be taking less damage because we did earlier. Oh, that was weird. <laughs> The charge indicator on the charge gun was there. Yeah, that's horrifying. Like, cracked and melting heads of the... That's horrifying. I'm not really sure why there's a... Like... Saucepan that's being butchered in his eyeball when the fight starts. Does this would be like a threat? Is there some relationship between mugs and saucepans in this world? Okay, I actually made it that time. I feel like we're cutting it a little bit close. Took one less damage. Dude, this axe, though, is like some shockingly dangerous. He's angry. Okay, that's fine. He's an angry face now. I like forget 90% of this battle right now. No, 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 no. No, stay around. Stay around. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Except for I was going to say we might get hit by a, might get by a chip. We almost had him. All right. So stage one definitely seems to be the one we're struggling with most. A little bit of practice on his later stages, and then we'll be A-OK. -okay. We have to have to get him out of his throne as soon as we can. Oops. Oh, that was close. Not necessarily intending to shoot his imps as much as I despise them. Alright, he's down. We didn't even get a full charge. I guess I didn't get any parries off that time. Any, uh, uh, Luke parries. Okay, I'm just gonna let that explode over there. And in with a super. Dude, 
these axes are ridiculous. I don't like them. I don't fully understand them. Alright, he's done. So let him with the charges. Oh, this is madness, isn't it? Why? Why? <laughs> Never mind, this stage is way harder. That was, I was supposed to jump before I did that. We still were almost okay with those chips falling. We might not be able to use this super on this fight. At least not that stage, because we can't stand still for that long. So I might go back to the invulnerability. Well, it went through him. That shot went through him. Excuse me. Ugh. What sort of a disaster is this uh, one's going? I still feel like we are generally being better. Oh, we're generally getting better at this first stage. And I might switch our super. I'm considering it. I'm very much considering it. Are you oh tilted immediately to retry? I don't know why I can't hit him when he's falling. It seems like you know when you'd expect to be able to hit him. Are you not dead yet? There he goes. Still took a point of damage. I really don't want to be taking any damage there. We'll open with our super. Yep, it's fine. Just keep making bombs appear over there. I don't need them. This is just a, a bit of a nightmare, isn't it? Ow, yep, yep, it's an absolute nightmare. Oh! Okay, I think, yeah, that stage we can't use that super, it doesn't work. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change our, our EX. Because there's no way we can stand still as chaos at that stage. I will take a damage. If we're going to be taking damage, I mean, I don't want to be taking damage. So our super art will go to invincibility. That, mm. <laughs> Number three seems I, unusable. I haven't been able to use number three very successfully yet. Here's a real high class bout. Just bubbles. Harmless, harmless bubbles. You know what? This stack's actually pretty good. Gives us an opportunity to hit him. It's not actually that hard to dodge. Get some decent damage in there during it. Dude, the, with the imp, come on. Oh, uh, just just kill me now. Yeah, okay, that's fine. I killed him after he's already dead, but it's fine. Here's a real high class battle. Hey, come on. Gotta get this like two player and have one player just shoot the imps. The other player focuses down. 
Uh, the devil. I'm missing a lot of damage here. Alright, he's down. First stage, flawless. Let's go to the second stage, where we can get past pretty easily that third stage, though. It's a nightmare. Remember, our super now is to become invincible. Which seems to be very useful during that third stage where it's just pure chaos. Whew. It's not too chaotic yet. Why can't I hit him? Excuse me? Yeah, I'm just going to switch to... Red shot. Come on with these platforms moving in ridiculous patterns. I didn't even zoom. I took two damages from falling down. I wanted to keep using charge shot. He was like not getting hit. I'm not exactly sure where his hitbox is in that stage. I don't like that spinning fire attack either. Ooh. Dude, the bubble just lasered me. I can't. Oh, okay. No, it's fine. It, we, we always get worse before we get better. This is the typical progression of our Cuphead boss fights. Everything goes really well. We almost beat him on the first try, and then we get really, really bad at it, and then suddenly we win. We gotta just. We just gotta continue to fight the good fight. Why can't we get uh, why can't we get HP generation opportunities like we do against King Dice? Ooh. Can't trick me. Nope. 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 Are you are you kidding me? You know what? I'm just gonna get eaten by the flames. I'm not gonna sit there and deal with that. You'll be at one HP. Because there's a fire spinning around while his giant skeleton falls from the sky. Oh, the imp spawning at the same time as his hands. God, you take so much damage in this boss fight just because of these imps. Shooting the spider head. Yeah, you, know, you don't need to kill the imps, but it's very satisfying when you get the opportunity to do so. Alright, he's down. He's down. He's down. On to the next stage. Full HP. Almost have our super cats out of my chair so I can get off the edge. Can I please actually charge my attack? Right, should be into the next stage any second now, right? There he goes. And then now his like it's weird when exactly we can hit him and I don't trust it. Uh, I, I am shocked that hit me. You know what? I'm just gonna take more damage here, so let's just ghost it up for a second. Alright, alright, down. 
We did it! <laughs> this like, last stage is so easy. Woo! Oh, is that second stage gets or third stage, I guess, gets really chaotic. That's gonna separate the men from the boys, that one. But we got through it, B plus, and expert mode is complete. Brothers have triumphed. Again. Expertly this time, however. And everyone's so happy because they have their souls back. Even though earlier they're trying to kill them, I guess of course they're trying to kill them, there was like they're trying to take their souls. Why don't you ever get the elder mug, the the, the elder kettle's soul? Why is it? Why isn't he involved in this? Why isn't he the final boss? What a twist! The elder kettle is actually the devil. All right. Do I want to? Do we want to go through and ace it all? I think we can. I think I can manage. I might at least give it a try. If I get too frustrated, I'm like, you know what? This isn't actually all that fun. Maybe I'll stop. Uh, but we can we can give a give it a try to ace these bosses. I can imagine the frustration, because as you imagine against those fights, if I'm like, oh man, we just, just to make one mistake, which can happen so easily due to the variation of the boss patterns. You can easily just get hit, like, oh well, okay, my flawless fight is ruined. Oh, we still have to do the running guns, too. You know, I'll do a bonus episode for at least the running guns. To flawless the running guns, maybe that's what I'll start with, flawlessing the running guns for extra mode. And if that proves to be too frustrating, maybe, we'll see, that'll be our test run, that'll be our test. Because that'll be how we finish extra mode and also be a... Uh, testing the waters for if I want to follow all the bosses as well. Anyway, thanks for watching. Like the video, subscribe for more fun. Twitch, Twitter, like as another deal. I'll see you next time. And your obscure compliment is that you have wonderful uh, nail hygiene. Sure, keep them nice and trimmed and clean. Good job on that. I'll see you later.